And uh, we start first up with a news break that's coming in uh, with respect to the arrest of Congress MLA Sukhpal Singh Khera in connection with the 2015 drugs case. In fact, a massive war of words that has now broken out with the uh, between the uh, Congress and the Aam Aadmi Party in Punjab. Uh, the Congress, uh, in its latest post, uh, post says that the arrest of uh, Sukhpal Khera is a proof of power and abuse of power and vengeance. Not just this, the Congress says that the entire Congress family stands with him against this petty conspiracy to suppress his loud voice against injustice. We are not ready to bow down, nor ready to stop. We will fight and win. So it's complete uh, widening of the cracks uh, within the opposition block. This as a Congress has now hit out at the Punjab. Uh, Aam Aadmi Party saying that the arrest of Sukhpal Khera is nothing but an abuse of power and vengeance on part of uh, the AAP government. Let's uh, listen into a reaction also that's come in, uh, coming in. But before we play out that reaction, let's go across to Amandeep as well. Uh, Amandeep, before we get to the politics of it, once again take us to the exclusive details of the SIT probe that we've accessed, which points to uh, speculations of, that are being made that there was an involvement of the Congress leader in relation to drug peddling. Well, absolutely, Samiksha. The, the details we have exclusively accessed from the police investigation is that this case has been registered in 2015 and nine people have been convicted in this entire case and this drug nexus is linked to Pakistan. One drug, main drug smuggler, the key drug smuggler, Imtiaz Alias Kala, who is sitting in Pakistan and who was in touch with this group of nine people and sending the drugs consignment in India and further to its destinations as well. And even this entire drug nexus has been managed by one person um, sitting in United Kingdom as well. So this is international drug nexus and nine people have been convicted. Out of that ex Sarpanj uh, Gurdev Singh and his driver Manjeet Singh was in touch with Congress MLA Sukhpal Singh Khera and his name has been cropped up during the course of investigation in 2017 as well Samiksha and when the police have sent his summon the, the Sukhpal Singh Khera has taken the legitimate uh, uh, step and in fact quashed that summon by approaching the uh, Supreme Court. But later the investigation was handed over to a special investigation team uh, on the orders of, of the uh, district court of Fazalka. And further, the SIT was headed by DIG Swapan Sharma. Swapan Sharma again investigated the entire matter and find out there is a role of Sukhpal Singh Khera into this entire hmm. drug nexus. And further, today morning, the police team of SIT has raided Sukhpal Singh Khera's residence and arrested him following the allegation. In the meantime, from 2015 to 2023, ED roped in into this entire drug nexus. Sukhpal Singh Khera has organized his son's wedding and the money that was used under um, uh, for organizing that lavish wedding that remain under the scanner of enforcement directorate. Enforcement directorate has challenged against, filed a charge sheet against Sukhpal Singh Khera in 2022 in a money laundering case related to this entire nexus. So ED case and even Punjab police case is all interconnected to each other and both the cases and both um, the acquisition against Sukhpal Singh Khera. So Sukhpal Singh Khera has been completely surrounded by the several evidences that is with police investigation and ED as well. But Congress party yes. is terming it as a political vendetta against Sukhpal Singh Khera since he was outspoken. Yes. yes. Uh, Amandeep, but talking about the political part of it, uh, the Congress here also claims that there was no arrest warrant that was served uh, when uh, the Congress leader was arrested. If you can give us details on that, was a proper procedure uh, in fact even followed uh, by the Punjab police? The police is having the discretional power, Samiksha. Whenever they find out anybody's role, they can detain him, they can question him, and later he can be arrested. So this is the discretional power, and he has to be produced before the court within 24 hours. This is the procedure that need to be followed by the police. And in fact, the police all of a sudden, and even it is it is a, a, a fair logic that if police gives a prior intimation to an accused that uh, uh, the, the, that they are coming to raid his at his residence. 
residents so how they can arrest that person obviously the accused will uh, will obviously free from the spot so this the procedure that has been followed it was all of sudden raid by sit sukpal khera has been arrested and he will be produced before the fazilka court within 24 hours and police will sort his custody in this entire nexus and produce and uh, quoting the piece of evidence against him in the court as well so this is the procedure but the son of sukpal singh khera mehtab singh khera is claiming that no procedure has been followed they yes. have received no summons they have never joined the investigation and even police have never asked them to join the investigation and in fact despite getting the relief from supreme court against the summons that has been quashed in the court uh, in 2017 as well so certain legal actions and mm. legal uh, steps has also been uh, roped in in this entire case but the point is that now the fact at the end of the day samiksha the fact is that sukpal singh khera congress mla for blood constituency has been arrested in an international drug nexus related to canada nine people have been convicted in this entire drug nexus which has been exposed in 2015 and congress party terming it as a political vendetta yes samiksha well that's right amandeep